So, oh, here we go. I'm driving and talking at the same time. Sorry it's dark. It's like 8 o'clock. Um, so one of the things... So today is April 3rd. Sunday, April 3rd. So one of the great things I love about business is me. Now, a little bit of an alliteration on that. Your business... You are your business. You are the, your, the face of your business. And so, when I got introduced to the business world, one of my biggest things was me. So, when I started doing business, I'm going to be honest. I am a different person now than I was when I first started. And, like, right now it's hitting me. Uh, one of the greatest things about my business is me. Because I am me. I'm great of today like we I you know it's the first Sunday of April Mormon Utah we had general conference yip de do um it was great afterwards uh, I was texting my friend so we went to hang out we went bowling so and we went bowling walked in um they gave the guy gave us two options okay so first we get there he goes okay well here's your two options of you can either go to this side the family side which is you know pg-13 and we could wait for half an, an hour so i or you could go to the 21 and older group side and bowl right away so basically we, we're not waiting we're just gonna go jump in and it was cool because we pulled it was super super fun you know etc etc blah 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 and the cool thing about me like two years ago so was walking by putting the stuff away and I looked over as I was passing this lady that was sitting at the bench with her laptop and me two years ago would have thought nothing of it you know, whatever. And I just simply said, huh, doing homework. You know, simple start conversation of, hey, cool, doing homework. I have, don't have a problem with it because when I was in college, actually, I've done my, I did my math homework in a bar. So, you know, conversation starter. We're just talking, you know, and kind of getting to know the lady a little bit of you know she's a school teacher she teaches at a sc charter school I think she said she was teaching third or fourth grade and talked about where she was from California how she moved here because you know California's California and it was like and she moved, how she used to be a realtor, now she's not, but when she's done, when she's doing online school, and when she's done, she's going to go back into real estate and do real estate stuff part-time, and it was just super cool to be able to see, to notice the trans, how do you say it, transformation in me, because me two years ago probably would have never went up to some random person and started talking to them. Uh, and it's great. Now we have, like, we exchange contact information of who knows, maybe she'll be a business partner in who knows, real estate or finance or whatever. But it was great to jump out of, I'm going to call it out of my something that used to be out of my comfort zone that's now in my comfort zone to be able to connect with people just by simply oh hey you're doing homework on your computer and in this you know the 21 and older side of the bowling alley and so we had a good 20 minute conversation of real estate finance school teaching and yeah, it was amazing. Like, you know, you, it's one of those things where it just happens. You don't know how to explain it, and you just do it. And it's extra motivating to do it on a bigger scale now. Go and talk to random people that maybe a person that does make is winning in this world. 
and seeing like what they're doing to win and talking about how you can help them and they can help you. So, yeah. You're great. My favorite thing, the thing I love the most about this business is me. So, yeah. Everybody, stay cool, stay classy, fight hard, win your goals, set your goals, and we're going to knock this world to take over. So, keep doing it. Keep being awesome. Um, if you haven't subscribed, subscribe, like the video, um, share the video if you want. Sorry, the video content or the graphics are not great. I don't know how to do that, but we'll get there one day. So, keep being awesome.